Welcome to Cole's World of Mathematics, where math is made simple and clear. All right, in this uh, video, we're going to be working on individual integral. It's going to be a basic u substitution integral. So we've got the integral of the square root of 4x minus 5. Um, an integral like this, you want to try to find the inside most part of that function, which is going to be that 4x minus 5. That's what you're going to let your u be. So we're going to let u equal that 4x minus 5. We're going to take the derivative of both sides, so we'll have a du is equal to a 4dx. All right, now we're going to go ahead and solve for dx, so we'll divide both sides by 4. We have a du over 4 is equal to dx. Now, after we get that done, then we're going to come back up here to our original integral, and we're going to start making some substitutions. We'll still have the square root sign. We can replace the 4x minus 5 with a u. And then we'll still have the dx right there. Now, in this next step, uh, probably what I'll do is go ahead and substitute a du over 4 for the dx. And then I'll make this u raised to the 1 half power. So now we're going to have the integral of u raised to the 1 half power. We'll substitute that dx for a du over 4. Now we're all in terms of u. So now we can start to work on this. We see a 1 fourth right there, so we're going to pull our 1 fourth out in front of the integral. So 1 fourth integral of u to a 1 half. Now we're to a um, problem here now that we can integrate. So all we have to do is add 1 to that exponent, keeping that 1 fourth out in front there for a minute. So we'll have a u raising um, that, adding <clears throat> 1 to that. We're going to have a 3 halves. And then in front, when we do that integration, we'll have a 2 thirds. We can go ahead and put the plus C on at that point. We can go ahead and multiply this. Uh, if you wanted, you could even reduce it before you multiplied it. 2 goes into 2 one time. 2 goes into 4 two times. So you could reduce it before you do that. Then we'll be down to a 1 over 6. We'll have a U to the 3 halves plus C. Last step would be to take that u and put it back in. So then we'll have a 1 sixth for x minus 5 raised to the 3 halves and then plus c. So again, just a basic straightforward u substitution integral. Um, pretty straightforward for that beginning Calc 1 student that is just learning how to do this. Definitely thanks for watching. If the videos are helping, please share with your friends so they can benefit too. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks.